YouTube, what the fuck's going on? I am here today <laughs> with a very different type of video. Uh, the last two days for me have been quite interesting. I have been getting roasted on Twitter for the last two days. When I say roasted, they've been flaming the fuck out of my ass. Why are they roasting the fuck out of me? Is it because my beard don't connect? No. Okay, is it because my forehead and my hairline fucked up? No. Is it because I didn't brush my teeth? No, none of those are the answer, okay? So, uh, two days ago, I, I was seeing people post these tier lists, okay? People were posting fucking tier lists for food and shit like that. I was like, I like cartoons. Why not post a tier list of my favorite cartoons, okay? I did not expect this to make people so fucking angry. It was something fun. It was something for for me and my people that follow me to fucking argue about, okay? But what I didn't expect, for some fucking reason, for the shit to blow up and me to get roasted by Twitter, which was what fucking happened, okay? So, I make it, I, I started the great cartoon fucking debate by accident, okay? I didn't mean for it to turn it to all of this this bullshit. Now I'm just getting roasted. Every, every day I wake up now, I get on Twitter, niggas be calling me stupid and be saying I'm born in 2000. I'm 22, bitch. I'm about to turn 23. I'm, I'm getting old, nigga. Okay, listen. Uh, so I'm just, I'm making this video to justify some of my answers that I put in this thing, okay? Now I know people in my comment section are gonna flame me too. I don't care. It's my opinion. Fuck y'all. So let's look at my list, okay? Okay, here we are. All right. Here's my list. Um, a lot of people were roasting me about how the fucking things were cut off. Listen, bitch. All right, I didn't have time to go and crop and fucking do every one of these. All right, nah, I, I did this shit on my phone. Yep, yeah, this legit took me forever to even do on my phone. Okay, so don't don't roast me. Talk about some do rag. Listen, okay, I get it. All right, the shit ain't crop. Fuck some of y'all. Y'all bodies. Be, I'm just, let me stop. Okay, this is not about. I'm not gonna roast it. So, here's my list. Let's start. <laughs> okay, so let's start at S rank. Um, a lot of people were saying Avatar didn't deserve to be S rank. I don't know what type of crack cocaine. I don't know what the fuck y'all doing. But out of all of these shows on this list, Avatar is the one with the best story, and I think the only one that can really rival. Avatar in terms of story is Samurai Jack and there's a reason I didn't put Samurai Jack in S rank but in terms of story you fucking idiots the only one that can even come close to Avatar in my opinion is Samurai Jack the rest of these shits just random Kids Next Door I love Kids Next Door I think Kids Next Door was amazing I think it was a good concept one of the best shows to come on TV easily S rank Teen Titans, do I really need to... It was people really saying Teen Titans not s rank. They were saying move that shit down to C. What's... What's wrong with you niggas, dog? Like, some of y'all built differently. Like, I don't understand. Like, it, it's... Courage the Cowardly Dog. Now, Courage the Cowardly Dog was one where people was like, bro, why is this s rank? This is s rank for me. Because as a child, I always love horror shit, okay? I love to be scared. Okay, why didn't you just look in the mirror, you ugly fuck? Okay, so go ahead and delete that comment, because I already know you finna say some dumb shit. Fuck you and your mama. Listen, uh, I loved horror shit, so for me, Curse was like one of them shows where I just always watch, no matter who. I always went out of my way to watch Curse, so I, I, I love Curse to Carolina. I do. Uh, so that is why I have those particular shows S rank, A rank. Why Samurai Jack A and not S? Because if I'm being real, why Samurai Jack is fantastic, has one of the best stories on this list. Some of the episodes of Samurai Jack were fucking boring. I, I'm sorry, some of them episodes was just boring as fuck. Like some of them just were not good, which is why it was A rank. I still think it's a wonderful show, has a wonderful story, but some episodes were fucking stupid. Uh, I'm sorry if you don't agree. I don't care. It's my list bitch. Okay. It's not about you It's about me uh, Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. I thought was funny as fuck uh, It's one of them shows I can still go back and watch this to this day half of us 
act like fucking Mandy now. So, I don't know. I just thought that shit was funny. Scooby-Doo, where are you? The original Scooby-Doo, not the new Scooby-Doo. This kind of goes back into the courage thing where I just like scary stuff and spooky stuff. Scooby-Doo, like, it's not, obviously, it's not fucking spooky now. But when I was a kid, I was like, oh, this motherfucker. I, I like shit like that. Why is it not S and, and it's an A? It's because I thought Courage was a better show. I didn't want to have two of the same, like, horror shows and, like, S, okay? Ed and Eddie, I don't think I really need to explain why that's S or why that's A rank. Uh, Ed and Eddie is literally a show about three niggas trying to finesse people to get a quarter. The whole show is about three little niggas trying to finesse for a fucking quarter so they can buy a goddamn jawbreaker. Nigga, that's the ultimate finesse. How is that not a rank? Okay, so that, anybody that said that shouldn't be a rank, y'all niggas don't know how to finesse. That's what's wrong with y'all. Let's go down and beat it. Why is Invader Zim is too low? No, it's not. Invader Zim is a good show, but it is very, very overrated. I do not think it's A or S. Like I said, it's a very good show. I just don't think it's a, a. I don't think it's in the category with Samurai Jack. I don't think it's in the category with Avatar. I don't think it's in the category with Billy and Manny or Ed and Eddie. A really solid show, but very overrated. That's why I gave it B rank. It's still a good show. It's just not that great. The Proud Family. The Proud Family is really good. It's a really good show. Is it an A rank or S rank show? Hell no, it's not. I, I know. I know. We black people. We love us some Proud Family. Proud Family. Listen, we know, okay? Uh, that shit, the shit was good, but is it like a show where I'd be like, "Damn, this is perfection"? Absolutely not. Hell no. Uh, hey Arnold, Hey Arnold is one of the ones that I kind of struggle with. Um, this is one of the ones I'll give y'all. Hey Arnold could be a rank. Hey Arnold could be S rank. I really think Hey Arnold was one of those shows that was too like. As a, if you're a child watching Hey Arnold, you're not gonna get a lot of this shit that's happening because it was some real shit going on in Hey Arnold. So, Hey Arnold is one of those ones I can flip flop. It can be A or S rank. You know, Hey Arnold can go. It can go. It can go up. Um, Rugrats can I go up? I'm sorry, you Rugrats Rugrats fans. I I I think Rugrats was okay. Uh, I think it was a good show. It was just some episodes were boring. I'm sorry. It was, some episodes are just fucking boring. Okay, uh, I can I can even see Rugrats moving down to, to C rank. Uh, Powerpuff Girls. A lot of people was like, "Why do you have the new Powerpuff Girls?" Okay, listen, bitch. I, obviously, this is about the classic Powerpuff Girls. I just used the new logo. Why? Because it was the first thing that popped up on fucking Google. Okay, stop, stop, fucking nitpick. Why do y'all even know that's the new logo? I. I had to look up to see there was a new Powerpuff Girls. I was like, what the fuck are people talking? Apparently, there's a new fucking Powerpuff. I didn't fucking know that, okay? Now I fucking know, all right? Um, Powerpuff Girls is a really good show. Really fucking good. Uh, do I think it's A or S rank? No, because it was good, but sometimes it was just like, eh, it was just a bunch of random shit happening. And sometimes I was just like, eh, it was like, sometimes it'll come on, I'd be like, man, I gotta switch the channel. Uh, Rocket Power. Rocket Power is one of the ones that are, it's really good, but I don't think it's that memorable for a lot of people. And it, it wasn't that memorable for me. Like, in my head, I can't think of, like, one Rocket Power episode that was super memorable, but I enjoyed watching it, so that's why I got B-Rank. Now, this is a big one. This had people pissed. SpongeBob. Why is SpongeBob B-Rank? SpongeBob is B-Rank because the first three seasons of SpongeBob, if we were going... Just based off the first three seasons of Spongebob, this would be easily fucking s rank. The first three seasons of Spongebob are some of the best, like, pieces of, of fucking media ever created. The first three seasons are perfection. I would even say the first three seasons of Spongebob are better than everything on this list. However, after season three of Spongebob... It becomes so fucking trash. And I'm not looking at just the first three seasons. I'm looking at the entire show as a whole. So that's why I said that SpongeBob is B rank. Okay? That is specifically why SpongeBob is B rank. You can't just look at the first three seasons and just be like, well, SpongeBob is S. It gave us memes. No, that's not how it works. After season three, SpongeBob is trash. And a lot of y'all be like, well, it, it lasted so long. It's because Spongebob is one of those shows that I, it, it's like good, 
But the first three season, seasons kind of set the bar for that show, and it never, ever even came close to that. That's why SpongeBob is beast. Not bad show, but after season three, it kind of trash. Kind of trash. C rank. Um, fairly odd parents. I think this fits. I think Fairly Odd Parents is a kind of mediocre show. It's like one of them shows you'll put on. You're like, oh, this is cool. But is it fire? Eh, no. Recess, uh, I think, is in the same boat. Uh, Recess has some some good episodes. It was funny sometimes, but would I go back and, and sit down and watch a couple episodes of Recess? Probably not. Now, Looney Tunes. I, I don't fucking care about y'all being mad that I put Looney Tunes at C-Rank. I do not fucking care that y'all think Looney Tunes is legendary. Looney Tunes, you know, Looney Tunes is a legendary show. It is very legendary. I mean, it's legendary as fuck. A lot of cartoons spawn from Looney Tunes. Uh, it, it, they do. However, that shit is boring as fuck to watch. I am fucking sorry. It is. I don't care what none of y'all say. That shit is boring as fuck. I do not care about what... It's boring, okay? It's c rank, okay? Is it a D rank show? No, because it has some funny shit. Like, there's some funny moments in there. Like, when Bugs was playing the piano and somebody kept coughing, he, he, he shot that nigga. Or he, the fucking Elmer Fudge, I'm gonna catch me a wabbit. Like, it has some good moments. But would I sit down and watch a ton of fucking Looney Tunes? Absolutely not. And you gotta also think, like, the amount of Looney Tunes I've seen compared to everything on this list is kind of minimum because Looney Tunes is kind of. It's kind of was kind of at the end of its cycle when I was growing up. Like when I was growing up, it was kind of it was still showing Looney Tunes, but it was kind of into like the kid Looney Tunes, and it was kind of dying off after that. Like Looney Tunes kind of came at the 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 end of Looney Tunes cycle kind of came when I was like like it, it was it was doing when I was growing up. It was towards the end of that cycle. So Looney Tunes isn't that impactful as it would be for somebody who was probably born in like the 70s or the 80s or some shit like that. It's just not that impactful for me. And it's not. Uh, D rank. Wild Thornberry's trash. I don't even need to explain that. I think the Wild Thornberry's is the worst show on this list. Uh, I cannot stand Wild Thornberry's. Every time I saw that shit come on TV, I skipped it easily. Wild Thornberry sucks. Uh, Chowder, I did not enjoy Chowder. A lot of y'all was like, Chowder is a goat show. I'm sorry, that shit was fucking, that shit was corny. Chowder was corny. Schnitzel, whatever the fuck, that little fucking, that dude that was black, he was black as fuck. I mean, Schnitzel was black, okay? I, I did not enjoy that show. I thought it was corny as fuck all the way over. If you enjoyed that show, that's on you. I just thought that shit was fucking corny, okay? Tom and Jerry. This was the biggest one. <laughs> this one made people the most mad. Why the fuck did you... I, I, I promise, if we go on Twitter, let's go on Twitter. Let me refresh. I guarantee you, one of these comments will say, why the fuck is Tom and Jerry d ring Okay, somebody's talking about Ben 10. We gonna get to that. We ain't got to that. Let's see. Tom and, Tom and Jerry. Where's Tom and Jerry? It's gonna come. Uh, Tom and Jerry. Oh, shit, nobody's saying Tom and Jerry. I promise y'all, a lot of people were really like complaining about Tom and Jerry. Look at this dude. This dumbass had the audacity to put Jimmy Neutron at the bottom and put Kids Next Door at the top. It's because Kids Next Door is a way better show than uh, Jimmy Neutron. I don't, I don't see how people don't see that. But that's enough. We'll, we'll get to Jimmy Neutron. But a lot of people were saying, like, yo, why did you put Tom and Jerry at the bottom? Um, Tom and Jerry was boring as fuck to me. I'm sorry. It was boring. I'm not trying to watch no cat chase no mouse with no, with no type of fucking, like, there was no dialogue or nothing. I'm not trying to watch no chat, no cat chase a fucking mouse for 30 minutes. Whenever this shit was on, I changed the channel to something else. I'd rather watch Nick Jr. than watch this fucking show. Um, I'm sorry. This shit ass. It, <laughs> a lot of people were capping for this show, and I'm like, bro, no, y'all y'all didn't watch this show. They just like, it's legendary. I, 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 none of these motherfuckers watched this show, okay? If you, when I was... <laughs> I was responding to people. They was like, why don't you watch Top of Jerry? I was like, because I wasn't born in the 50s, okay? I'm not watching this boring-ass show. I'm sorry. I like shows that are entertaining, and Tom and Jerry was not fucking entertaining to me, okay? Ha How many times I'm gonna watch a fucking cat try to kill a mouse and fail, okay? I'm sorry. This motherfucking Tom never won. It was a waste of fucking time, okay? Trash. d rank. Foster's, I'm sorry, Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends, it has some entertaining moments, 
but for the most part, it was whack as fuck. It was corny. That little blue blob was corny as fuck. His little fucking chocolate milk brother was corny as fuck. That big head boy, what's his name? Mac, Max, whatever the fuck his name was. Corny as fuck. The rabbit, corny as fuck. The only thing redeeming in that show was Wilt. Um, the basketball nigga with one arm, okay? That little bird, Coco, was fucking whack. Eduardo, that big motherfucker that kept crying, whack. I'm sorry, that entire show was whack. I'm sorry, it was whack. Jimmy Neutron, trash. I'm sorry. I, everything about that was trash. It looked trash. The animation was trash. The the characters was trash. Sheen was fucking trash. That will Carl trash. Jimmy, oh he's smart. That's his thing. He can brain blast trash. Uh, what's the little girl was annoying as fuck. The little black girl was too. She was just annoying as fuck too. The teacher. Rah! Jimmy, that's annoying as fuck. Dad was stupid as fuck. That show was trash. I'm sorry. It was it was awful. Ben 10. Um, another a lot of people were mad about that. Ben 10 and S rank. No, I'm sorry. I don't think Ben 10 was that good. Um, whenever I watched it, I would watch like I watch an episode and then another episode would come on after that. I'd be like, I'm good, fam. Um, this was one of the ones my friends flamed me about when I uploaded it. Uh, when I showed it, because I showed this to my friends before I uploaded it to Twitter, and Ben 10 was the biggest one they flamed me for. Uh, they were like, bro, Ben 10 D rank, what the fuck? I just didn't enjoy Ben 10. Um, I I just couldn't, I don't know, it was just like one of them things, I just could not get into Ben 10. And if you look on Twitter, like, a lot of people I responded to about Tom and Jerry and Looney Tunes, but I didn't respond to a lot of people when they were telling me, like, like yo, Ben 10 needs to be higher. Because, like, my thing is, like, I didn't really have an argument for Ben 10. Because Ben 10, it just didn't click with me. So, it wasn't like, I was like, oh, fuck Ben 10. Ben 10 trash. It was like, I put Ben 10 at D because it just couldn't click with me. Uh, I, You notice, like, Ben 10 is one of the ones I didn't say was like, oh, it's fucking trash. Like, it just, Ben 10 just didn't click with me on a personal level like it did with a lot of y'all. Um, I would watch an episode and it just, I'd be like, this is kind of boring to me, but, um, Ben 10 is one of those ones where I probably would appreciate, and the thing about a lot of these shows, like, a lot of these shows I've seen as an adult, like, pretty much every show on this list I've rewatched as an adult, except Ben 10. Ben 10 is in the Wild 4 series. I, I ain't watching the Wild 4, that shit ass. Uh, Ben 10 is one of those ones I probably appreciate more as an adult, but, that is why I made the list the way I made it. A lot of people are still calling it trash, which is fine. It was my fuck. The point was, it was my opinion, okay? People don't get that, okay? Uh, but I started the great cartoon debate by accident. Uh, I don't, listen, I don't care what y'all think, okay? It's my fucking opinion. Fuck y'all. If y'all don't like it, then create your own goddamn list that's better than mine. Um, but yeah, this is my list. This, this is, hey, it is what it is. So, hey. Hey, I explain myself, okay? Now explain y'all self in the comment section why y'all pick, why y'all put certain shows above certain shows. I'm not put Tom and Jerry and Looney Tunes at S rank just because they left me there. I didn't enjoy them. I just fucking didn't enjoy them. So, um, hey man, I'm working on an anime one. I don't know what else to say to you motherfuckers. If you don't agree, then you don't agree. But explain to me why you don't agree. As always, motherfuckers, I know this is a different video, but past class, doty dads, I'm out.